Yeah, so this is probably the worst kept secret of all time. Outside of Michael. <laughs> I'll find Pete. Like Michael. Michael, Michael, Michael. 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 Fuck yes! <laughs> Hi, my name is Michael Reeves, and I'm joining Offline TV. I'm from a very shitty little town in Hawaii. There's not much to do there, so I spent my time uh, learning how to do computers and not uh, anything else. So near the end of high school, I realized I was failing almost every single one of my classes and I realized that I would need to get a job afterwards because I, I need to feed myself and not die. So instead of focusing and improving my grades, I instead paid even less attention in school and focused 100% of my energy into learning how to code. And eventually I did get a job working as a software contractor for the government. And it was going really well. I was making more and more, really progressing my career. And then somewhere along the way, I, it just all went wrong. And now I make YouTube videos on the internet for kids. You guys actually just popped into my YouTube recommended like two years ago. Hell yeah. The first three people I knew, Toscar and Lily. I used to watch some League stuff before I even saw Offline and I, like I knew who Scar was. Dumbass Katarina plays. I'd seen some of like Lily's music covers, I think. And then I found out about everyone else um, as I got into Offline. You guys might not know this, but I was the first person Michael Reeves DM'd and I ignored his messages. He DM'd me saying I did a great job with one of my videos. Looking back, I should have said thank you, but I was just really lazy to reply. Michael? Yeah, what do you know about Michael? Uh, I mean, he's nice. <laughs> I mean, the way I know Michael Reeves is he's like a kind of a cool tech YouTuber. I don't really know if I would consider him tech though. He's more like a comedy tech YouTuber. So it took two hours. Ah! 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 He simultaneously builds 12 and 25 at the same time. He's Filipino. He likes building robots and he likes chasing people. I think I DM'd Michael. We were like, we're fans of you. And it turns out he was fans of us. That's pretty cool. We we're like fans of each other. I thought his videos were really funny. I knew he coded. I feel like I have like a special place in my heart for people that code for some reason because it was like my favorite class in university. I watched a couple of Michael Reeves videos and I could really tell like this guy's a complete fucking jackass like out of his fucking mind type dude. But I like that shit. My first impression of Michael Reeves is that he was very smart and it's easy for me to recognize that because I too am very smart. Yeah, it's pretty obvious, like, he just really has no friends, so he has to hang out with us. You know, take pity on him, he looks like he's 12. My impressions of each individual haven't really changed much. I think they're, they're just about the same as when I first met them. Fed's really good at uh, c content stuff. He's one of the better YouTubers that I've seen on the platform. <laughs> <laughs> Lily's like that shy, quirky, ooh, ooh friend that you have that you don't know what's up with them. They're always kind of, uh, kind of like off a little bit, and then you realize it's because they're addicted to crystal meth and she's a crackhead. Gara. Fed. Gara, I guess every house needs a token boomer. Pokey, she's like, fuck, I can't find anything fucking wrong with her, and it's annoying. Like, I know, you know, there's something like wrong. Toast, I don't know why they brought me in when they already had another sarcastic, dark haired Asian gentleman, but you know, I guess they wanted to. I've been hanging out with Offline a lot recently, trying to decide if I want to. Uh, be a part of it or not. We, we've we been just like, you know, having dinner, uh, doing lots of stuff. I went to Japan with them. Absolutely nothing weird happened. It was a great trip. It was totally normal. Um... <laughs> it's very exciting. You know, for the last two years, I was the newest offline TV member. And it's nice to have someone else that people can bully and shit on and just haze. Hey, buddy. What the fuck? Get you, you fuck. Oh, I actually think working with Michael's gonna be fucking great. I can tell when I look at his videos, he storyboards and he has a really good grasp of like comedic timing. So like I really like both his editing style and how he structures videos. I don't storyboard shit. <laughs> you know, I think a lot of the time, like I do a lot of dumb shit. You know, there's kind of like another force in the house to kind of balance things out. 
or make them worse. There's a lot of potential working with him. He seems like a very eccentric kid. <laughs> oh, every time he has like an idea for something, he's like, you're gonna be in it. But it involves like a lot of teasing. I mean, I'm down, sounds exciting. I just really needed like test subjects for videos. And now I have, what, fucking six, seven, eight of those fuckers? Do you know how many people I can taste? Oh what the my fuck? Michael! What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> so after a couple of very long days, I'm finally moved in the offline TV house and I'm really excited to see what we can do here. Good to go. And action. Ah, fuck, it's the elderly. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> 